Yo, guys, it's Down the Field Podcast. We're here with another podcast episode. The first one, actually, a little while. The last one we did was our pre-draft. So, yeah, it's been a little while since we've done one of these together. It's our actual podcast where we're going to cover and put all of our cuts and stuff in. So, um, Evan, you can put whatever cut you want right here. Let's go ahead and cut. We're here, you guys. Um, We're going to do our first topic, which we're going to start. We're going to actually, let's open it up. With what have the Cardinals done? What have the Cardinals done? Nothing. Nothing. We signed Zach Pascal. What? talk the host of this is zane so zane what have the cardinals done i don't know <laughs> no they no what did they do with their receiver uh, uh released him they released their best receiver deandre hopkins we nobody is really sure where he's gonna go but apparently the browns have been moving by and put, like putting some major moves to in order to get it so that would be Utterly insane. They, he's met with the Titans and the. He's meeting. He met with the Titans and he's meeting with the Patriots next week. I want him to be at the Patriots because everybody else I don't really like. The Patriots are okay, but so um, Evan, what are your thoughts on the D Hop release? Well, I mean, kind of biased because like he said he wasn't interested, and they said they weren't interested to get D Hop the Cowboys at least. So that sucks. <laughs> but my, I mean. I'm not excited as in, like, excited that he's leaving the Cardinals. I'm just excited to see where he ends up and how it just, like, because I'm almost with the, uh, I was about to say uh, Steven Adams, but with um, Adams and the <laughs> and the, and the Raiders, um, which didn't really do much anyway, but, like, just to see, I mean, if he, like, goes to the Browns, like, that would be really interesting, just the effect that it, it goes by them. They would go from the last in the division to third in the division. Yeah. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Ah, I mean. I thought it was stupid because Zane, what did the Cardinals get out of that D like out of D Hop? Nothing. Cap so, space, I guess. I don't know. They we're rebuilding. We're hey, rebuilding. Got something. We're real, we're they rebuilding. had enough cap space, like you anyway. Got, you you got got a though. seventh round pick, and you guys got nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. I don't know. So we're all that segment, and uh, let's go on to WWE. <laughs> Bloodline's dead. I don't know what's going on. It's pretty bad right now. All right, next segment. <laughs> the Eastern and Western Conference Finals. One of the final, uh, one of the Eastern, or one of the Conference Finals was a blowout 4 0. Nuggets take the victory. The other one was Jimmy Butler took a 3 0 lead and then almost blew it. But in game seven, Jimmy clutched up and Bam Adebayo and Jimmy moved on to the finals. And Caleb. Be- Butler made a broad claim. He told one of his f- famous friends, he said he bought her a plane ticket to Denver and said, we will be there before the series even started with the Celtics. Wow. Butler also, they, the Miami Heat scheduled a plane, like a flight to Denver before they even won game seven. So, yeah, they got some pretty broad claims. And Jimmy Butler, in quote, said, I'll hold the next one whenever yep. they were trophy. I saw that, so, yeah. Uh, I mean – Right now, it's a two-one series, and if the Nuggets win, I think it's either tomorrow. I think it's tomorrow. If, yeah. If the, the Nuggets win that game, this series is basically yeah, over. Exactly. All right. This one we're all going to talk about: Dalvin Cook being released. Everybody it's saw this. Miami. My so Dalvin Cook, the 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 Minnesota Vikings posted a like on their Twitter. It was a banner, and it was all their key players. It had like JJ on it, Kirk. But they put their backup running back, James Madison, on it instead of Dalvin Cook. That was a few months ago. Everybody knew, all right, something's happening. They released him. Everybody's saying he's going to go to Miami. So, Evan, do you agree with this move? Honestly, I really don't. Because, like, 
to be mm-hmm. honest, like, I mean, sure, he's Dalvin Cook's been playing all right with them, but I think just with the development of Justin Jefferson and just, you know, whatever quarterback they're like just gonna have to deal with, even if it's, you know, like Kirk Cousins or freaking I don't know, Tua, what whoever they at least get at some point who's better than Kurt. I'm I'm joking about the Tua thing. But like he Dalvin Cook's one of those guys who just like at least for the Vikings was like just a reliable kind of a veteran guy who's not always yeah. like outperforming, but he's, he's just kind of like their he was kind of like their glue. Exactly. He's the glue. He's the Kevon Looney of the group. Or not yeah, 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 yeah. Hayden, what do you think about this? I mean Kind of salt coming. Um, I don't know. It's just I honestly have have really no opinion on it. All right. Um, I mean, we we all saw this coming, but I don't really know where he's going because the Dolphins. I mean, it would make sense, but I don't really know. They don't have as much cap space as everybody yeah, thinks. They have to exactly, yeah, have cap space. <laughs> I Tyree kill like all right. I'll get ninety five percent of the cap, and everybody else can have five. Is that fair? Yeah. <laughs> like that's not gonna work. So we're gonna cut to NCAA baseball. So, last week we had some people or some uh, teams advance from the super region or from the regional, which those players were Duke, Virginia, TCU, Indiana State, South Carolina, Florida. Or- or Roberts, Oregon, and yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Arkansas had two bad losses to TCU, which I was at, one of them. Um, Duke tonight, they beat uh, Virgin- number 11 Virginia in game one of the Super Regional by mm-hmm. four. TCU is Indiana State, the bottom of the ninth. Ah. Now, uh, four to one. <laughs> <laughs> South Carolina, four Ending all the other games are pending. Uh, there was a game last night, I do believe. Um, why is this so far in the future? <laughs> Tonight, let's see if we. Ha- I know we had well, at least one game last night, right? No, okay. Um, I did not. Some of the super. Re- there were some crazy things like Oral Roberts. They were down. I think it was they were down eight zero, and they came back and won the game fifteen to thirteen. Which is I watched that game. It was absolutely insane. Clemson and Tennessee. They they matched up head to head. Went to I think fourteen innings, and then Clemson finally collapsed and gave up a run to Tennessee, and they couldn't answer mm-hmm. back. And another thing that happened was Auburn went 0-2 in the regional. Oh oh oh, that Oklahoma State <laughs> went 0-2 in their regional, their own regional. So it was pretty sad for that uh, to be, uh, you know, to be on that lose the losing end. Mm-hmm. Florida, there was a crazy game between them and Texas Tech, the first, the winners bracket game. Florida lost, came back, and then won the next three games, which was honestly nuts. Um, the regional we were matched up with I mean, nothing. Ah. Ah. I mean, TCU just blew our Arkansas out twenty to five game, and then the next game it was. 14-5. Just not a very good situation. Arkansas pitching was not on that day, but that's all right. We'll not get it. Horrible. Extra. No crap. We- Hit one home run, like a one two shot, one four, one, two four shots. So a grand, two grand slams, and a, a two run homer. Mm-hmm. It's. I mean, it's okay. We're probably not going to do anything next year anyway because you know the hogs. It's 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 taxes, death, money, and hogs choking playoffs. That's all mm-hmm. it is. Horrible. I'm just kidding. Well, it is. Mm-hmm. Or just football, you know, we suck. <laughs> but anyway, football. not a good for baseball, but there was a lot of things that we could take away from what happened. I mean, Wake Forest is obviously the most dominant team currently, and I think that they are going to win it all. But anyways, that should do it for our podcast. Any? Does anybody else have anything to say? Don't you just love the Josh Allen cover of Madden? Oh, oh yeah. Oh, no. Because you try to stay. Psych! Josh Allen cover. I completely forgot about this. Oh. I am... Yes, agreed. Mm-hmm. Allen cover. I, this year, I am not I buying like Jefferson Just... or Jalen. Because if somebody pulls the Patrick Mahomes where he's freaking flying. Ah, ah. He is <laughs> the game with Mahomes somebody, throwing that ball. If somebody is playing against me and they just go. Did he die? Comes again. 
I cut my own time. Yeah, everybody's pissed about the the man cover. Nobody wants nobody wanted it. Nobody needed it. Um it should have been at least somebody decent, you know, somebody who doesn't cry. No bro. <laughs> like someone Jalen like Hurd. that. Jalen Hurd. I bet. Hey, Justin Jefferson. Yeah. Adam I bet. Anyways, um, I'm gonna quote one of my favorite before we end, I'm gonna quote one of my favorite quotes of all time, quoted by somebody. Indiana the twenty twenty four championship. End it. Cause you try to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away. But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes.